For the first time in recorded history, our species, human beings, have sent a high-definition video signal across the galaxy using a high-powered laser beam. This signal traveled millions upon millions of miles across our vast, great cosmos. A monumental technical achievement for humanity that ultimately delivered a long-sought glimpse of a cat chasing a laser pointer. Yes, the experts over at NASA, who once landed a man on the moon and sent a probe to the far reaches of the universe containing a golden record of the diverse life and culture on Earth, just focused their efforts on what's basically a 15 second cat meme YouTube video. As of press time, our cat clip here has nearly 400,000 views on YouTube. It's no Mr. Beast, but not bad for an unlisted link. And hey, who the hell are we to talk? Anyway, NASA cat laser video sounds like a random string of search keywords that brings up a lot of questions. So let's try to answer them. First, who's the cat? Well, the cat's name is Taters, and it's a three-year-old orange tabby that belongs to a visual strategist who works at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory as part of this mission's team. There he is in this WebEx video. And there are actually lots of Easter eggs about Taters encoded into this video. Taters' heart beats per minute are registered here and here. This video captures Taters at a less flattering angle. And down in the corner, we can confirm that the subject here is Taters the cat, the species is an orange tabby, and the cat appears to be on the fifth of its nine lives. Second, why a cat video? Well, NASA says their December 11th test of this cat video was inspired by the first experimental broadcast television transmission carried out by RCA in 1928, which featured a little figurine of the character Felix the Cat. And third, why a cat video of a laser? Well, as the leading scientists at the National Aeronautics and Space Administration note, cats like to chase lasers. And of course, this video is part of a demonstration involving a laser transmitted from deep space. So this 15 second cat video clip was sent to Earth from NASA's Psyche spacecraft, which is 19 million miles away. Psyche is on a mission to reach a metal-rich asteroid that's between Mars and Jupiter, and NASA loaded this video onto the craft before it launched it into space back in October. NASA says the Psyche spacecraft is equipped with a cutting-edge instrument called a flight laser transceiver, which beamed the video signal via a laser to a telescope at Caltech's Palomar Observatory in California. NASA says the stream took 101 seconds to reach Earth from, again, 19 million miles away. In a span of time that's faster than the recommended cook duration of a ham and cheese hot pocket in a gas station microwave. The test was also carried out at the system's maximum data transmission rate of 267 megabits per second, which, again, is probably better than the internet you're watching this on right now. Given that according to speedtest.net, in November, the median download speed for fixed broadband in the US was about 219 megabits per second, and for mobile, about 106 megabits per second. That's from, you know, local cell towers, satellites, and the cable running into your house. Not a spacecraft 19 million miles away. Really puts our internet providers on blast here. Then again, what else would you expect when one of the major internet giants still effectively mentions the telegraph in its name? Finally, why exactly is NASA using a laser to send cat videos 19 million miles through outer space? Because NASA wants to improve communications from deep space especially as astronauts are getting ready to return to the moon, starting in late 2024 with the Artemis II mission's lunar flyby, and eventually future trips to Mars. And this cat video test demonstrates technology that can send data back to Earth at rates 100 times greater than radio systems that are currently in use. And as NASA notes, one of the goals here was to demonstrate the ability to transmit broadband video across millions of miles. So let's hope these tests keep working so we can keep meme culture alive and well throughout our solar system. What is the chance? Eating a meal? A succulent Chinese meal?